Gemini, hi. Your energy reading the 15th to the 22nd of July. Gemini. Gemini, looking for calmer waters. You have a lot of emotion here. You have a lot of um, passion. I'm going to call it passion. You got a lot of passion for love. No, who is this, darling? Who is this? You want someone to recognize you. You want someone to reach out and talk to you. It would make you feel very, very happy. You have been struggling. There's no doubt about that. I can see it here that you've been struggling. Your ship hasn't really come in. There seems to be something here, the possibility of maybe having a date or meeting somebody by the end of the week. But I don't see you really wanting to participate in that. Gemini, what I see is probably not truly a broken heart. Uh, the possibility that that has passed, but yet there still seems to be a longing for somebody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Very, very strong longing for somebody. And that somebody could be a Capricorn, a Sagittarius, a Libra, a Taurus, a Cancer. These are the signs that are on the board. But there's, it seems to be a, a good week, but a lot of wishing and hoping and turning down the possibility of a date with somebody who is very, very strong. Maybe they intimidate you and you don't want to go out with them or something. Very intimidating kind of a person. Very strong person who knows what they want. So this is what I have for you for your weekly reading. Namaste. Libra. Libra, hi. Your energy reading the 15th to the 22nd of July. Libra. Libra. Libra, you're not... Re okay, so I have a very sad feeling wrapped around you right now. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, possibly. Feeling very, very sad, somehow heartbroken. But I don't feel that it's a love heartbroken. But there is heartbreak here, some sort of feeling despair. There is a shift that's coming towards you, and that's probably why you're feeling this way. A messenger is coming by Thursday. By Thursday, I see a messenger coming. Whoa. Okay, I was going to ask you if your birthday was coming, but no. Is somebody's birthday coming? I've got a lot of people coming together here uh, this week. Now, this could be a weekend thing, but I've got celebration. I have a marriage card. I have a lot, a lot, a lot of people coming forward. And I have success for you. I have success. And then a lot of people. And then celebration. Okay, so buy a lottery ticket. I have success. And a lot of people. And then celebration. I'm say either you're going to win something, or buy a lottery ticket, or some really good, outstanding news is coming your way. So, get rid of this feeling that all is not well. And I, I just got a beautiful week coming in. I just wish I knew what it was. But, wow, a lot of people coming together. So there seems to be. Um, there seems to be another Libra. There seems to be a, uh, a Gemini. Wow, another Libra. There's an Aquarius. There's Aries, Pisces, Sagittarius. There's a Leo and a Virgo. Lots of people coming together. Okay. 
It sounds like a wonderful week. Get rid of the blues and prepare. It's beautiful. No mistake. Aquarius, hi. Your energy reading the 15th to the 22nd of July, Aquarius. Aquarius. Aquarius, you get a ship coming in. It's a ship of healing. Okay, I think you're having a hard time healing. You keep jumping back in the pot, though, darling. When somebody spoons you out of the pot, don't jump back in. But this is a, a constant habit of overthinking. So I feel really good. And then all of a sudden I, f I, I get a thought. And that one thought takes me into a land of many, many, many thoughts. You're very anxious about something concerning money. Very anxious. Aquarius, this week, it just, you feel that you're working and working and it's getting you nowhere. You feel um, overly anxious about something. You've also been trying to uh, take one step ahead into the now, but you keep slipping into the past. The sun is not shining this week, darling, but there seems to be uh, there seems to be a very emotional week here. But the weekend a door opens, and this door opens, I don't understand. This door opens, but you close it again. Aquarius, you're you're either um, having a hard time dealing with something. Or you just don't have the faith in yourself that you should have. There is some good news coming towards you. But for some reason you become very anxious. And everything falls apart. Or so it seems. The energy here is coming into the weekend. And there seems to be some sort of a visitor coming. Now this visitor could be. A grown person with a teenage child so they could be coming to visit and a door opens but this door you close it immediately again so I don't quite know what that means but I do feel that it's a very anx anxious week and anxiety ridden week for you not quite sure uh, there's a Wishing that finances were better. But all in all, your first two cards are the ship coming in and the healing card. So just know that healing is on its way. It doesn't come all at one, once, so don't get anxious about it. It comes little by little by little. Take your time and make sure you take care of yourself. So Gemini, Aries, Sagittarius, Libra, Virgo, Pisces, Virgo, Pisces, and Capricorn. And there's another Aquarius here. Namaste.